Hello everybody, it's Mark Sadler, founder and publisher of Best CAD Tips. Today I have a tip about Revit and how to fix a problem that I experienced with the background color changing at uh, an unexpected time. Uh, I was working along and the white background changed to black, all the line work changed to white, and it was uh, a bit puzzling and uh, took a little work to figure out what was causing it. But I did figure it out and uh, came up with a solution that I'd like to share with you. So here is the tip, and I hope you find it helpful. This is the detail that I was working on. It's a section through part of a canopy. And as you can see, the background is white and the line work is black, and it's, everything is the way you expect it to be in Revit. And then all of a sudden, without warning, it changed to look like this. And with a black background, white letters, white lines, and a black background may right. work fine in AutoCAD, but it's just not what we expect to see in Revit. So uh, I had to, after it happened a few times, I had to trace the keys that I had hit to uh, try to determine what was setting this off. And I found that there was a command called Canvas Theme in Revit. Canvas Theme. And uh, the hotkeys that toggle it on and off are CA. So if I just hit CA, boom, it turn, turns back into a white background. There's another way, if you don't remember the letters CA, uh, Canvas Theme, there's another way to make this change, and that is to right-click in an empty space in the screen, look for the shortcut menu, and uh, right near the top is uh, Recent Commands, Canvas Theme, parenthesis, CA. And so you can also repeat the most recent command, which was Canvas Theme. It's right here in the menu. Click that, and it changes. Right-click, Recent Commands, Canvas Theme, and it changes back. Another way to access this command using the ribbon is to go View Tab, Canvas Theme. So very simple, very easy to fix, and uh, it happened to me a few times, uh, so I, I would be surprised if it's not happening to you as well. So thanks for tuning in and listening, and I uh, hope this is uh, useful to you in your work, and I will see you next time.